Hey, Steelers fans! The season opener has already brought problems, with a critical injury that could impact the team in the coming weeks. You won't believe what just happened and the words said to Mike Tomlin. But first, let's go to an update on the Steelers' offseason, which was marked by a tireless search for reinforcements, and one of the main targets was wide receiver Brandon Ayuk. But unexpectedly, the story took another turn. An insider Jay Glazer told what really happened, and it will surprise you. Leave your like and let's watch the video. The long-standing saga involving the Pittsburgh Steelers' pursuit of wide receiver Brandon Ayuk came to a dramatic close recently. Despite months of negotiations and an apparent agreement during the 2024 NFL Draft, ultimately, Ayuk chose to re-sign with the San Francisco 49ers, inking a four-year, $120 million deal, ending the Steelers' hopes of adding him to their roster. NFL insider Jay Glazer revealed that the Steelers nearly secured Ayuk in a trade. According to Glazer, speaking on Fox Sports, NFL, the deal was all but done when Ayuk, amid ongoing contract talks with the 49ers, unexpectedly arrived early at the team facilities. He came in to talk to coach Kyle Shanahan that day, Glazer reported. Shanahan then tried to intervene with the front office who were finalizing the trade to Pittsburgh. In a last-ditch effort, the 49ers presented Ayuk with a stark choice on that pivotal day. It was basically, accept our final offer now or we're trading you to Pittsburgh by the end of today's practice, Glazer explained. Choosing to stay put, Ayuk accepted the 49ers' offer, securing a lucrative $30 million annual paycheck. This decision came after a standout 2023 season where he emerged as quarterback Brock Purdy's primary target grabbing 75 passes for 1,342 yards and seven touchdowns. Over his four-year NFL tenure, Ayuk has accumulated significant stats with 269 catches for 3,931 yards in 62 games, proving his medal as one of the top receivers in the league. Drafted 25th overall by the 49ers in 2020 from Arizona State University, Ayuk has lived up to his collegiate reputation as a dynamic playmaker, a trait the Steelers were undoubtedly eager to add to their lineup. And if you thought the twists and turns ended there, fate had another blow in store for the Steelers in week one of the season. The Pittsburgh Steelers are facing a significant setback early in the season with punter Cameron Johnston sustaining a serious injury during their week one game against the Atlanta Falcons. Johnston, who signed a three-year, $9 million contract in the offseason, was brought in to resolve ongoing punting issues and had quickly made a positive impression with his powerful punting abilities. During the game, Johnston was injured while attempting a punt that would have pinned the Falcons deep in their territory. The severity of the injury led to kicker Chris Boswell temporarily taking over punting duties. Post-game, Steelers head coach Mike Tomlin expressed deep concern about Johnston's condition. Cam Johnston appears to have a serious injury, Tomlin stated. I'll have more information next time we meet. It's truly unfortunate because he's been exceptional not just in his performance, but in his professional approach since joining us. Johnston had quickly become a fan favorite, with Tomlin previously highlighting his potential impact during training camp. This injury not only dampens the spirits following a week one victory, but also revives past frustrations related to the team's punting situation. The Steelers now find themselves once again in the difficult position of potentially having to explore options for a new punter if Johnston is sidelined for the season. Cameron Johnston's injury further complicates the team's outlook. Of course, the season is just beginning, but the challenges are already piling up. Now, the big question is, can the Steelers overcome these initial obstacles? Leave your opinion in the comments and click on the video that appears on your screen to continue following everything about this electrifying season.